Blitz.io. Welcome to Japan Trip. On this channel that introduces all of Japan, starting from Hokkaido, we will take you on a journey through videos, region by region. In the 12th episode, we will showcase Saitama Prefecture, known for its historical streetscapes. Saitama Prefecture has often been teased as the least attractive among the Kanto region, even inspiring movies based on its reputation. However, it is actually a densely populated area with a lot to offer. So, let's embark on this special journey together. Kawagoe, also known as Little Edo, is a charming tourist destination located in Saitama Prefecture, Japan, where historical streetscapes from the Edo period still remain, exuding a rich traditional ambience. In this article, we will introduce the history, tourist spots, events, and local cuisine of Kawagoe. Kawagoe is situated about 30 kilometers from the heart of Tokyo, making it easily accessible. During the Edo period, it flourished as an important post town connecting Edo present day Tokyo and Weno, and even now, it retains much of that historical charm. The most significant appeal of Kawagoe lies in the well preserved old town atmosphere. Narrow cobblestone streets and storehouses with traditional architecture vividly convey the ambience of the past. Areas like the Kurazukuri Street and Kashiya Yokocho are particularly popular among tourists. Lined with shops, restaurants, and traditional confectionery stores converted from old storehouses, visitors can enjoy the taste of tradition. Moreover, Kawagoe boasts numerous historical buildings and landmarks. Some representative tourist spots include 1. Kawagoe Daishir, a temple founded during the Edo period, which is one of the most important Buddhist temples in Saitama Prefecture. Visitors are greeted by a magnificent Nyaman Gate, a spacious precinct, and a splendid main hall. 2. Kawagoe Hikawa Shrine, established in the early Edo period, this shrine serves as an important historical heritage, reminiscent of the ancient capital of the era. The Autumn Festival and the Winter Hikawa Festival are particularly famous as local traditional events. 3. Former Kawagoe City Museum Kujengakutaku House, designated as an important cultural property, this former merchant house from the Edo period has been preserved. The interior showcases exhibits and antique furniture that recreate the lifestyle of that era, making it an interesting place for history enthusiasts and architecture fans. 4. Senpakuji Temple, an early Edo period Toshoga shrine, enshrining Tokugawa Ayasu, the first shogun of the Tokugawa shogunate. The beautiful gardens and buildings are highlights, making it recommended for those interested in Japanese history and culture. In Kawagoe, various events are held every year, with the Kawagoe Festival being particularly famous. Held in October, this traditional festival allows visitors to enjoy the vibrant culture of the Edo period with decorative festival floats and lively performances. Furthermore, the local cuisine of Kawagoe is also enticing. One must-try specialty is the Kawagoe Shumai, featuring a unique wrapping made of minced ingredients. Once you taste it, you'll be hooked by its deliciousness. Kawagoe is a delightful tourist destination where Japan's traditional allure is still richly preserved. We highly recommend visiting and experiencing its unique charm. Chichibu is a captivating tourist destination located in the western part of Saitama Prefecture, Japan, known for its beautiful nature and historical landmarks. With its lush mountains, clear streams, mystical temples and shrines, and traditional festivals, Chichibu offers a diverse range of attractions. In this article, we will introduce Chichibu's natural beauty, tourist spots, local delicacies, and the best seasons for tourism. Chichibu is situated approximately 100 kilometers from the heart of Tokyo, making it easily accessible. Throughout the year, Chichibu attracts numerous tourists with its picturesque landscapes and various tourist spots. First, let's talk about the charm of Chichibu's nature. The region is abundant in mountains, with the Chichibu Three Mountains, Mitsumine San, Ryasen San, and Gongen San being revered as sacred mountains attracting worshippers. 
These mountains offer ideal hiking and trekking opportunities, making them appealing spots for nature lovers and climbers. Chichibu's valleys and rivers are also beautiful, providing opportunities for activities such as camping, barbecuing, and river play. Chichibu is home to many historical temples and shrines. One of the representative landmarks is Chichibu Temple, famous for being one of the three eccentric festivals of Japan with its extravagant festival called Kurayami Matsuri, which is designated as an important intangible folk cultural property of Japan. Additionally, the Hikawa Shrine on Ryaganzen and the Mitsumine Shrine are also popular as power spots, surrounded by stunning natural scenery. Chichibu's tourist events are also captivating, with the Chichibu Night Festival being particularly famous. Held in the first half of October, this festival features a luxurious and magnificent parade of elaborately decorated festival floats, attracting many visitors. The Chichibu Anbashira Festival, known for its winter spectacle where massive pillars are carried through the town and lit on fire, is another well-known event. Don't miss out on Chichibu's local delicacies. Local specialties using regional products are available. Chichibu Soba is a local dish featuring delicious buckwheat noodles served in a flavorful broth. Additionally, Chichibu's Doboroku is a locally produced alcoholic beverage, and visitors can also enjoy local craft beer and wine. The best seasons for tourism in Chichibu are from spring to autumn. In spring, cherry blossoms bloom beautifully, while autumn brings stunning autumn foliage. With its abundance of nature, historical landmarks, delicious cuisine, and traditional festivals, Chichibu is a region packed with charm. We highly recommend visiting and experiencing all that it has to offer. Mitsumine Shrine is a historical and picturesque shrine located in Chichibu City, Saitama Prefecture. It is one of the Chichibu Three Shrines and holds great significance as an important Shinto shrine that has been revered by the people of the Chichibu region. It is also widely known as one of Japan's power spots. In this article, we will introduce the history, festivals, access methods, and surrounding attractions of Mitsumi Ne Shrine. With its ancient origins, Mitsumi Ne Shrine is said to have been established when Empress Jingu Jingu Kogo enshrined a spirit from the Kumano Sanzan. The shrine is located on the summit of Mount Mitsumi Ne and enshrines various deities, with the main deity being Oyamazumi no Makoto. Throughout history, this area has been a place of mountain worship and an important site for ascetic training. Particularly during the medieval period, many ascetic practitioners gathered here, and the shrine became well known for its mountain faith and miraculous powers, carrying on the tradition of devotion. Mitsumine Shrine hosts various festivals and events throughout the year. The most famous is the Mitsumine Festival, held in early May. This festival features rituals and a procession of Mikashi portable shrines on the summit of Mount Mitsumi Ne attracting many worshippers and tourists. Other important events include the mountain opening and autumn ascetic training. Furthermore, during the autumn season, the Mitsumi Ne Mountain Autumn Foliage Festival takes place. As the mountain and its surroundings are adorned with vibrant autumn colors, many people visit to enjoy the fantastic scenery and find solace in Chichibu's beautiful nature. Access to Mitsumi Ne Shrine is mainly through trains and buses. Visitors can take the JR Chichibu Railway to Mitsuminaguchi Station or Raisenshi Station, then transfer to a bus to reach the shrine. Alternatively, access by car from within Chichibu City is possible, but drivers need to be cautious due to the mountainous roads. Situated in a nature-rich environment, Mitsumi Ne Shrine offers not only a spiritual experience but also enjoyable sightseeing around the area. Mount Mitsumi Ne, one of the Chichibu Three Mountains, offers hiking and trekking courses, allowing visitors to ascend to the shrine while enjoying the natural scenery. Especially during the spring and autumn seasons, the beautiful cherry blossoms and autumn foliage enchant visitors. Mitsumi Ne Shrine, as a fusion of history and nature, is cherished by many as a power spot. We encourage you to visit and experience its mystical atmosphere and breathtaking landscapes. 
The Omiya Railway Museum, located in Saitama City, Saitama Prefecture, is a fascinating facility where visitors can enjoy Japan's railway culture and history. With diverse exhibits and interactive corners, the museum appeals not only to railway enthusiasts, but also to families and tourists. In this article, we will provide a detailed introduction to the history of the Omiya Railway Museum, its exhibits, experience programs, and access methods. The Omiya Railway Museum opened its doors in 1987 and has since been embraced by many as a place to learn about the development and history of Japan's railways. The museum was constructed to commemorate the 100th anniversary of the founding of Japan National Railways now JR Group and was designated as an important cultural property of Japan in 1989. Since then, it has continued to attract visitors with numerous exhibits and events, establishing itself as an enjoyable destination for both railway enthusiasts and the general public. One of the main attractions of the Omiya Railway Museum is its diverse range of exhibits. With a floor space of approximately 6,300 square meters, the museum showcases various railway vehicles, models, photographs, and documents. Visitors can not only experience the history of Japan's railways, but also learn about the latest railway technology, making it a unique feature of the museum. Firstly, the exhibits include vehicles from different periods, ranging from the late Edo era to the modern day. Steam locomotives, electric trains, Shinkansen bullet trains, and freight trains represent the evolution of Japan's railway vehicles. In particular, the exhibition of the first Shinkansen Zero Series and the world's fastest linear motor car L Zero Series garners significant attention from many visitors. Moreover, there are interactive corners where visitors can actually board and experience the vehicles. Both children and adults can relive the excitement of their childhood days. Apart from exploring the interior of the displayed vehicles, visitors can also sit in the driver's seat, providing an irresistible experience for railway fans. Furthermore, the museum boasts an extensive collection of model railways and dioramas. Elaborate dioramas with a lifelike resemblance allow visitors to enjoy the sight of trains in motion as if they were real. These exhibits have received high praise from model railway enthusiasts. The Omiya Railway Museum regularly holds various experience programs. Among them, the most popular is the driving simulator experience. Participants have a valuable opportunity to sit in the actual driver's seat and operate a simulator, allowing them to experience what it's like to drive a train. This program is well received by people of all ages as it provides a sense of the enjoyment of train driving. Additionally, the museum offers workshops on model railway building and train illustration techniques, catering to a wide range of age groups from children to adults. Participating as a family or parent-child duo offers an excellent opportunity to share the joy of trains. The Omiya Railway Museum's facilities are also well equipped. Inside the museum, there are cafes and restaurants where visitors can enjoy meals while appreciating the exhibits. The Omiya Railway Museum is a valuable place to enjoy Japan's railway culture and history, making it a recommended destination not only for railway enthusiasts, but also for families and tourists. We invite you to visit and immerse yourself in the evolution and history of Japan's railways while having a delightful time at the museum. The Saitama Super Arena, located in Saitama City, Saitama Prefecture, is Japan's largest multipurpose arena and a popular venue for various events, concerts, and sports competitions held both domestically and internationally. In this article, we will provide a detailed introduction to the history of the Saitama Super Arena, its facilities, major events, and access methods. The Saitama Super Arena was completed in the year 2000 and officially opened its doors. It was designed by the world-renowned architect Kengo Kuma, featuring a large-scale and state-of-the-art facilities. The building has a dome-shaped roof and can accommodate up to 37,000 seats, making it suitable for hosting large-scale events such as concerts and sports competitions, garnering high praise both in Japan and abroad. The facilities of the Saitama Super Arena are highly comprehensive, providing all the necessary equipment to support the success of various events. 
Firstly, the main arena serves as the main stage for concerts and sports events. The seating area is spacious, and the high ceiling and modern lighting fixtures create a powerful atmosphere for events. Next, the sub-arena is designed for smaller scale events and exhibitions. The arena's size can be adjusted to accommodate various purposes. Furthermore, the facility includes convention halls, meeting rooms, and exhibition spaces, making it possible to host trade shows, conferences, corporate events, and more. Additionally, there are food and beverage booths and merchandise spaces, allowing visitors to enjoy meals and purchase souvenirs while attending events. The Saitama Super Arena hosts a wide variety of events. Particularly, the following major events are among the most popular. Concerts. Numerous concerts by famous artists and bands from Japan and around the world are frequently held, catering to fans of diverse music genres. The lineup ranges from top Japanese artists to international superstars, making it appealing to a wide audience. Sports events. Sports events such as basketball, volleyball, figure skating, professional wrestling, and martial arts competitions create an exciting atmosphere. Especially, basketball and volleyball matches can draw passionate fans, sometimes filling the arena to capacity. Live entertainment, various entertainment events, including idol group performances, comedy duos, and stage plays are hosted, providing an opportunity for both fans and artists to enjoy the experience together. Access to the Saitama Super Arena is commonly done by train or bus. The nearest station is Saitama Shintoshin Station on the JR Saikyo Line, which is about a 10-minute walk away. Additionally, the JR Musashina Line and Tobu Skytree Line are also available. Furthermore, for some events, special buses or shuttle buses may be operated, so it is recommended to check the access information in advance. The Saitama Super Arena is located in an area known as Saitama Shintoshin. The surrounding area is well equipped with commercial facilities, restaurants, cafes, and movie theaters, providing an enjoyable time before and after events. The arena itself is a modern and beautiful building that exudes an impressive and exciting atmosphere. As Japan's largest multipurpose arena, the Saitama Super Arena is a place where various events come to life. With a diverse range of programs, such as concerts and sports events, visitors are sure to become enthusiastic fans after just one visit. It is a popular tourist spot not only for locals, but also for many people who come from afar, so we encourage you to visit and experience the excitement it offers. How was it? Japan Trip will continue to post many videos that will make everyone want to travel to Japan. Please let us know in the comments the places you would like to visit when traveling to Japan. We'll keep posting interesting videos, so please subscribe to the channel and give us a thumbs up. Oh,